Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. More Fallout London today. The last time, we had uh, disembarked the submarine and been roaming around the ruins of London. Some of the taller buildings this time around. We've been meandering around. We ran into the standoff between a sketchy trader and some police folk who we helped out by basically telling the guy I would beat him up if he didn't give them their money. And so we got a little bit of money that way. Continued around, here at a distress signal from a long dead person and found the Womble, which appears to be the London equivalent of Death Claws. So that was fun. Add a couple of times to that. Build it. Then we uh, walked up a huge spire to find a record, which was quite disappointing. We made a stop to a subway station, which had nothing in it. The Jack the Ripper Museum, which had nothing in it. Except for a locked door that we could not get into, and we will never get into because we're not going to be leveling up perception that high. So, outside the Jack the Ripper Museum is where we will resume today. And we're outside what appears to be the fifth column place. If you remember, the Jack the Ripper Museum is right there. And then we have the fifth column place here. I wasn't sure if this was their actual base or what it was. Where's the key? Okay. Maybe it's just a... ...faith house for them. If I join them, I can come here at some point. Maybe it's part of their storyline. I think those are the only entrance ways to the place. Oh. I just heard someone say something. Where's the dog? this little area, and we can head down to the Tower of London, see what's going on there, so, oh, be an enemy of some sort, like, right there, oh, he disappeared on me, where'd he go? Maybe it's a rat or Because we have sneak, we no longer set off traps, which is great. Was that that dinghy we saw that I could... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Right, 
check this dock. I don't know why I quick save before going in the doors. It automatically saves when you go indoors. Auto save. Judging by the uh, blood, body, I'm guessing we're finding the cannibal raiders in here. Well, there's here. Is this one of those we come in the trap and then we have to fight our way out? Kind of one oh, we're going to find here. like they just didn't expect you to get up here. Like they just put stuff on the edges there to look like there was more stuff up here than that. Good tactic. Like, it's from down here you, you can't see up there. It doesn't matter if there's stuff there or not. It is weird that there's no one here, right? What you will about the cannibals, at least they're washing their hands. Eat. <laughs> you can really tell which dog they like the best. Wait. Oh, these were doors. I still have it. 
heard from anyone here. Come on. Just rude. Bruce is trying to look. I think Bruce. This is raw aluminum. Huh. Okay. Wait. So this dinner fork. I can steal. Everything else. Not stolen. What's this terminal say? Reflection on the night of loss. That was old terminal work and I cleared out all the crap from the docks. Just need a place to rant. I've been thinking a lot lately about a night that etched into my memory. Wanted to put my thoughts down. It's a heavy one. But I reckon it's time to get it off my chest. A while back, Scavenger in gray and yellow PJs burst into Barbara. Just like that, life as I knew it changed. My sister Clove and I became orphans. Left a whole left to navigate a world that suddenly seemed a whole lot colder. You see, Mum and Dad, they were a bit rough around the edges. I'd call them hooligans, but they were our folks. They loved us in their own way. It wasn't about chaos for them. It was survival. No one else was willing to lend a hand to a family like ours. In the midst of their unconventional life, Mum and Dad, I'm sure Chloe and I never felt love. It wasn't easy, and people judged them, but they held on to love and care when society turned back. Now as I'm typing down these words, I can feel the weight of the loss. Chloe and I are left picking up a piece, trying to carry on with the strength and resilience our parents down to it. This ain't just a tale of tragedy. It's about the complexities of family. Unexpected twists that life throws at you. In the face of it all, we find our strength. And in the darkest moments, the human spirit of how we tell them. Vengeful speed. Hey, Terminals, Bruce. I've been doing some hard thinking since last night. And it's time we set things right. Clove and I are hatching a plan. I reckon you, my little nuts and bolts friend, wanting on the details. I had hoped that with that. Scrapes together, let's walk by a little trace. We could buy some muscle from the local zoo again. However, somehow Clove managed to persuade the local beef eater that it's time that scavenger in the yellow and gray pajamas were paid for what they did to Mom and Dad. Here's the gist. Clove's gonna take cover in the old tobacco docks warehouse. Now I'll be posted up on the bridge, waiting for our mysterious intruder. Once they show their face, we'll lead them right into the trap. Now here's the twist. We ain't just gonna lay into them. Nah, we're gonna play into our hand. Feel who we are, catch them off guard. Here's the kicker. We're all said and done. We're planning on a surprise move. Clove and me's gonna step out of the shadow. Gonna throw them off the dish best served hot lead. If that fails, be a fuck lot. I'm guessing they mean there's a fuck lot of beef eaters from all apart. Risky game, but we've done being victim. Time to turn the tables and show that scavenger consequences of messing. Yellow and gray. And gray pajamas. 
gotta be like a reference to something, right? And I just don't know what it is. Hey, Clove, you, uh, you good? What if I, like, try to push you out of the, out of the way here? You gonna do anything, or... I mean, she's not hostile. There's no reason to kill her. In fact, I want a quick save. I'm gonna kill her, see if she has anything on her. No! No! Bruce! Let's You have nothing really. It was load. I was maybe thinking she'd have like a note or something like Yeah, Bruce died and so I'm the last one left and yada yada, but if she's the only one here, then there's no real point in it. So what happened? down from here. Well, I'm guessing this was the Beef Eater's hideout, or is. No, no well, if he's typing on that terminal. They have to be using this place as their, like, base, right? No idea. But anyway, I think they mentioned a bridge. And the guy in the yellow and gray pajamas. I'm trying to think of, like, media that I've seen about gray pajamas. But I just cannot think of anything. There's the door. Lock. And lock. The column is... More fake doors. I suppose this is the bridge they're talking about? Like an ambush happening? Or this bridge? I'm gonna investigate the ship. Yeah, just bomb, but. There should be some guy named Bruce around, unless I've already killed him. In which case, he's no longer around. Not a boat. Oh my god. I don't know why that scared me, but the game crashed. Um, oof. Well, luckily we saved just a couple of seconds beforehand. I'll have to re-kill him and stuff, but that's just... scared me when it crashed. I, I don't know why. Okay, so we are just outside the tobacco place. We're going to walk around that way, but we can go in this direction now. Yeah, as I was saying, we may have already killed uh, this guy named Bruce before. Yeah. 
Are those hand bones just like jump up and fall back down to her? Alright. Churchill, can you not like walk over everything? No. Hapless. Oh, now I'm carrying too much. Great. What am I actually carrying? Sort by weight. No. Halberd weighs the most amount. This thing, which is four dollars per pound, profit. Four per pound. Four per pound. Um, that one is really good. We're not selling that one. That's my only. Um, that's like three per pound. I might even pick up these crude guns. We'll just do that. Churchill, can you get the hell out of my way? Oh my god, Churchill, move! On the body pins. somewhere if we've already killed him or what but ah uh, an advanced trunk we very well could have just killed him and not realize it now it's not like i pay attention to uh who i kill when they try to kill me right I'm not sure what other bridge they could be talking about, if any, you know? Looks like those are the only ones that, uh, been around here. Oh, this is where we've come through before in the past. We've been through here. Okay. Unless they're talking about this bridge as the one they were going to use. But, I don't know. Anyway, let's go to the government rationing center. Hopefully I can crash the game. Try that again, shall we?
do 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 I'm getting so many crashes now. We'll try to fast travel over there one more time, and if it doesn't work, we'll just walk over. But I figure we can try to sell some stuff. And from there, we can take over the Tower of London. I say take over, but it's more like we're just going to kill everyone inside of it, right? I don't know. Work this time. Excellent. Boy, come, come a little closer. I don't want to go all the way around, bro. Churchill, can you stop making like disgusting? We're noises? back in business, but we're a bit skint now, thanks to you. Yeah, yeah shut up. How about you do us a solid and buy something? I'll make up for it, mate. Come on. Looking to buy, got? are ya? Let's get down to business. Oh, I think. Okay. Well, obviously, I can't really uh, buy anything from him since he has no money. But do you have things like right away? How are my actual, like, levels of... Right away, nine. Stim packs are at 18. Okay. So here's what we'll do. Let's go ahead and sell everything that I have that I do not want. And... <coughs> I will just go ahead and, ooh, actual combat shoddy. Might hold on to that, baby. No, why would I? Because I'm a melee person. It doesn't make any sense to hold on to it. Cigarette, classic. But yeah, anything we, um, need, we can just buy some... Radex, not Radex, right away or impact. You need to. Just a pain. Play two each. I'd be better off putting those in a place somewhere. <clears throat> Does that repair me or? No, oh, I'm just gonna. There. Miscellaneous. Shaped charge. Shaped charge is mission. Didn't I pick up like a bunch of shaped charges? I feel like I did. Anything else got weight here? Oh, well, the rest of the thing is just junk. Some of my lead balls. Oh, these are shaped a rocket, my bro. I'm never going to be using rockets, so sell those. I'm not going to be using shotgun shells, sell those. Gamma rounds, never. Flamer, never. The rest of the stuff I could potentially use if I find a thing for it. But anyway, let's go ahead and buy a couple of Rataway. They're like 300 each. We'll just buy two. That was three. Whatever. I'll take it. Okay. Should sell some junk, but all this good stuff. Okay. Now how much do I weigh? 227. That's fine. Churchill, shut the hell up. Now we've got a couple extra rattle rattle away. And that's one of the uh, the major issues with our survival is right away. Um, as we eat stuff to gain health, we gain radiation. Also, of course, we use stem packs. But, you know, 
Hmm. All right, all right, all right. Um, I don't think I can enter from this way. I think I see our lunch. But let's. I think there was an entrance around the other end, right? Is that the dinner bell? There's got to be another way to get in here. Maybe like a hole in the wall. A gate that is huh? open. Something like that, right? Who's there? This is like a story thing. Won't be able to get in from anywhere. like a bridge across this way. Looks like no. I guess the only way in is that gate that's locked with like a master lock. I don't think there's any way for me to like, unless. I suppose I can like jump on top of this somehow. If I could like walk up there, maybe. But yeah, I don't think I can jump up this high. Unless there's like a little. Nudge, I can jump onto first. Nope, okay. Alright, never mind. We're not going to the Tower of London. We're gonna be going, um. I guess let's just go further this way. I'm gonna map out this area. That's a shame. Wait, what if I use this one? This might work. Hold on. Oh, baby. Coming for ya. Get on top of another ledge somewhere. <laughs> the answer appears to be no. Hmm. It seemed like it would have been a good way. Hmm. Interesting. Where am I at? Over here. That's fine. I'll just go ahead and go back to the tobacco dock. The flamethrower has a tendency to explode. Okay, I'm glad I, uh... Rid of it. I, I doubt it, actually. Pretty sure you can just, like, shoot it. When they're using it when it explodes. Okay. Okay, so we're here, and let's go this way. We'll go to the college. Did I search this? Our houses? I did. Yeah, so a bench. A melon. How about this? Oh, no that one's sealed up. Okay. <clears throat> Good to know. This bridge, maybe? Please. It's you Bruce. have to help me. Hey, Bruce. Who are you? Someone in desperate need of your services. Please. You have to help me get revenge. They killed my parents. Why'd they kill your parents? Wrong place, wrong time. 
My parents were completely innocent. Oh my god, it's but, Bruce Wayne. I mean, those hooligans. They just tore through the place. Slaughtered my mum and dad like cattle. I was out running errands with my sister. The scene we came home to. But we'll make it right. I know where they'll be. I'll take you to them, but we've got to hurry. His name is Bruce because his parents are dead. Is that is that the reference here? I don't know about the yellow and gray person yet, or why he has a sister named Clove, but let's squish him. Thank you. I'm gonna save real quick. So don't, uh... I'm not wearing the proper colors. I don't think I'm the target of his revenge, but this definitely feels like a trap. Well, why would he be trying to like trap me? Only well, didn't kill his parents, right? And like he said, them when they were kids, right? There, that's the place. There's a side door around back. You can get the jump on them. A stealthy move. Maybe even kill them in their sleep, or... But your sister... Just then. go. Get in there, and let's get this started. Hey, hey, Bruce. Um... Well, since... There's a door around back, and... It was locked anyway. Might as well get some experience. Or extra experience. And by unlocking it, getting the five experience for doing so. In. All right. Objective is now to talk to Clove and her. Thank you for helping me get my revenge. On you. What do you mean? With the filth that raided my home. Yeah, they were hooligans, but they didn't go out raiding or nothing. My parents stayed home, took care of all of us. Who? What do you mean? I kill their parents. I feel like I'm like the same age as them, am I not? Also, it makes sense why that place was trapped, because he told us to sneak in that way, right? I should probably uh, heal a bit. What do we got for healing? I don't get it. I was expecting to find, like, a guy in, like, striped pajamas or something. And I was grown in a... Was I grown in a tank? I mean, it is possible that before all this happened, I killed their parents. But, he said that they were kids when that happened, right? I don't know... I, I'm so confused. I'm just very confused by the whole thing of it. 
Actually, no. Oh, it does. Does that do anything, or is that just like just cut off? Like a. I mean, maybe at some point I would have to do this to like get something in or out. I'll just leave it up for now. It's still so weird. I'm just confused as to why, like. I killed their parents. Allegedly. Oh, hey, bud. That's not cool. First, we're going to take a spin pack. I can find them. There we go. And then... That one. Hold on. Holy oh, Ah, you bastard. Okay, there were a couple too many guys there. Oh, I'm, I'm like one XP from leveling up, aren't I? Save me like literally right here, okay. Three is what we're getting. And one second while I take some rat away as well. Okay. Another fifth 
colonist. Cable Street School. This building here. Well, let's find a way in and we'll take a look. Inaccessible. Wait, does that mean some of these might be accessible? Here? Nope. I get me pretty cool. I can. Maybe this is their headquarters since they're so close by. Take a gander at it, huh? It's a top. Oh, hey. Y'all good? I can smell cowardice a mile away. Huh? I got a mate. Here. Where are you going? Find A for it, ain't it? I mean, I guess. You guys good? How you doing? Do you mind? Do you I mean, mind? Not really, no. I don't mind. I guess this isn't their base. Uh, I can just take stuff. Hostile, comrades. I'm going after them. Fuck. Fuck. Maybe they are also exploring and clearing this place out. And that's what the lore of this is. I I mean, it does make sense that, you know, there are other people who are here clearing out settlements and stuff. But this stuff apparently I can't take. I mean, this is... The legendary one, X. Okay. How to say excellent one. It died so quick, it threw me off. By the way, did I mention I tried some wafers the other day and they were acceptable? Like, they weren't the greatest thing or anything like that, but they were, like, covered in chocolate. They might have been better. Fine day for it, ain't it? What the hell kind of school layout is this? A classroom with the only door going to the cafeteria? Hey, watch what you're doing, okay? Ooh, a fifth columnist. Oh, oh how's, the, how's the uniform? Uniform is kind of bad, to be honest. It's not even worth anything. Is there anyone in charge around here? What about you, black, black shirt guy? Oh, this uniform also sucks. I guess they're just different colors, huh? Excuse me, miss. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna... How you doing? Wait, I want that. I need it. Why can't I pick it up? There we go. You and the dolls now feel like old friends. You can't imagine life without them. If they're guiding your presence. Excellent. Here, huh? Right. just picked up right there. Ooh. 
Also, I think I want that crystal decanter over here. I think it has a crystal in it, which I can use for a Krubin beacon, right? Mind where you're going. Oh, you mind where you're going. Get out of the way. How about you? Are you anyone important? Another one. Just another one. Okay. Hmm. A fork. Do you mind? Keep Camelot where it belongs in the past. Okay, so they're just propaganda. Camelot and the gentry are ripping England apart. Join the fifth column. Okay. So it seems like the fifth column is like the ones who are trying to be like, yeah, we're the government. Like the Enclave. Except maybe less evil since they're not attacking me on site. Churchill, shut the hell up. One of these days, Churchill. One of these days. Ha! Boom! Straight to the middle. basically has this place secured, but they don't have the inside cleared. A little bit. Ooh. What? Oh, from above. Oh, look where the hell should be from. Since we're talking about London here, do you suppose we're going to get a reference to the Daleks? Oh, hello there. Really, one hit? Okay. I'll take it.
We're letting them. Extra hot. Hey, Protectron, violence won't be tolerated. I don't know why you're trying to attack me. And I did nothing wrong, first of all. Just like mouth agape. Well, I did not expect that. Please step into the open and identify yourself. Law abiding citizens. <laughs> Let's try that again. this then how is this protect button in the as tanky as a death block? Or a wombo I guess. Legendary one up here. AB. Oh, there it is. Okay, still got the same one. Perfect. Well, not perfect. It would have been better if we had a different legendary effect to it, but. really anything else up here that was important. It was just that one hollow tape, which I really need. Nothing else down here either. So okay, let's head up. Yeah, kind of a shame there was nothing here at all that was of any value to well anyone. Yeah. Free, apparently. Oh, it's the Kilroy was here meme. Great. Station. That's every play. 
place around here marked off. Just mind little... where you're going. How about you mind your own business? Check out this tree icon over here first. This building. Our ooh, legendary rad stag. Just free stuff for me. Problem. If you loot, I grab loot. I'll just do it. Got a petrol station, though. storage box just for that, huh? Got a bunny in it. over there. Hmm. Oh crap. <laughs> I didn't actually want to fall, but okay. I'm gonna save before I drop down again. <laughs> okay, that's why. They made blood packs actually give you more HP in this mod, because from what I remember, blood packs only gave you like one HP. Right? Go. Save again. 
That's a lot of hooligans over there. Do I have any grenade-like things? I got a molly. Let's go. That was actually a great Molotov. Like, I did not expect to kill two of them, almost a third. I was just expecting it to do a little bit of damage, but it turns out it did a lot of damage. Okay. Let's sit down and cook for a second here. Bacon. Oh. God, I want bacon. Bacon is one of those things where it's just like I could eat endless of it, right? stuff. Any... not that expensive. Or someone just say stumped. Or the hooligan scum who said something. Whatever, anyway. There is a marker on the map, on the compass, that looks like a waypoint marker that you can set yourself. That's odd. Where am I at now? Here? Okay. Well, let's head back this way. How much is the flamer? Oh, that's good. In terms of price. Well, price per. Put this way and go over this. What's there? I think that's where some of the hooligan voices came from. without getting pushed down. So that's why we're uh ahead and allow that cheat right there. Okay, so I can't get across to them. Doesn't look like I might I think I could jump from here to there. 
if I can get a running start at it. Give it a try. Oh my god, he did it. Yeah. The madman made the jump. Oh, that pocketed thing there. Eh, nope. Not working though. Okay. I was honestly not expecting to make that jump. I was expecting to like fall into the water and have a really bad time about it. But, uh, we made it. I cannot believe how irradiated the Thames. Like, even in normal Fallout, the water is not this. <laughs> What is this circle icon? I guess I still haven't gotten it mapped. Not in the compass yet. talking about huh that doesn't tell me i can't go that way maybe i got too close oh maybe this is like near the edge of the thing yeah nowhere for us to go let's take a look at the bank first this just opened so there's probably not going to be much here Find your chest. From what you found, then I'll care. Bank vault master. Easy. Bank vault security. Terminal. Apparently, security is not as the actual thing itself is. Right, major. That works. Security update. Once the recent incident, repair operations in the bank vault are going full swing. Real mess, yada yada. Okay. Well, I was hoping for like an override for unlocking the bank vault or something. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing here. But let's go ahead and just take a look inside. Never mind, let's actually just take a look inside. I was gonna just cheat and take a look without taking anything, but I mean, if it's open, why not? That's advanced, can't take that. No, I'm carrying too much, I cannot run now. I don't know what's in this thing. Well, how overweight are we? Three pounds? Probably get rid of that by eating something. But didn't I have, where was the, um, the pot of tea? Yeah, why don't I pick a couple of those that will lower my stuff there. Then, gave one more time, just forgot. Let's go visit the Tem Folk markets, and we'll see if I can sell some stuff. And then we can also drop off our loot at our uh, usual place. Mm. Man, I would really love to find a place that we can drop stuff off at. 
It's you. What are you doing here? In my own business, if I'm doing. I don't remember what. Ah, oh, is that? I think it's right. Your kind does have two eyes, right? Hey there, Wayfarer. Need any medical help? Chems. Fix me ups. This would be so much easier if, like, they didn't, like. <sighs> between Nothing everything. like a good. Because you have to listen to the voice. Up. It sucks. I hate After it. The one thing about this mod that sucks work. is them having to, like, read out the lines every single time and not letting you, like, skip them. It's the worst. The absolute worst. You know, I honestly consider selling this never-ending gun. However, it's literally saved our life twice now. Meanwhile, this gun barely does any damage. Like, I just don't know what I should do with it. that way? Or that? I don't even know why I have that on. Look, the surgical gloves, I still have them, even though they weigh a pound, but like don't do any protection. I don't know why. I just do. Okay. Go ahead and trade that stuff for now. And then... I'm never going to be using cryo cells. Probably never going to be using flamer cells either, but for now, let's pop and sell on those. Railroad spikes, probably not going to use. Shotgun shells, not going to trade. All right, flamer fuel. Grab you and just drag you down to 71. All I need out of you. Thank you. All right, and now if we go to aid, how much is your stuff here? About the same. Let's sell the rest of the flamer fuel. And then I will grab two of those. Like that. Excellent. All right. Now then, let's head back over to Greenwich Station. Okay. So, next level up, we're going to put another point into Charisma. If there's nothing else that we absolutely need to get before that. I don't remember the exact levels we earn the next rank and stuff at. But then we'll have three Charisma, which means the next level, at level 17, we'll be able to buy the Lone Wanderer perk. Or Lone Survivor perk, whatever it is. <laughs> And when we can, then we can dismiss the dog from our inventory, our inventory, our uh, following here. And with him gone, we can then uh, have an extra 50 carry capacity. And I think we take 50, is it 10 or 15 less damage? I forget what exactly. We have to sell this stuff, whatever. Let's just dash what we can for now. Might as well store the uh, drugs and stuff that I'm not going to use. I wonder if you can become addicted to kids' meal. That would be hilarious. Uh, let's store the ladybug meat. I haven't had a uh, one of those for a little while. No sense holding on to the stuff. We're probably not going to be able to use it for a bit, right? Wafers. Let's store the pot of tea. I already have some stuff I think that can cure addiction in my inventory. Let's store that away because that's two pounds, right? Rapeseed, the razor grain, the roid, the rice. Wait. 
already in there. The Nirn root, which is very clearly Nirn root, uh, but it's Cinderon's root here. Store that. Store the firework meat. Store the strawberries. And that's it. All right, now let's just go through anything that has weight here. Cthulhu doll. Someone else had it. Shape charge right there. Okay. Now we just store all of our junk. Oh. Okay. Done and done. Excellent. Shut the fuck up, sure shell. Jesus dog. Can't wait to get rid of him. Alright, let's go to the Tower Hamlet Pindar station now. And once we're there, we'll just wrap up the video. So, everyone, thank you all for watching. Second thing, if you want to see the Tower Pindar station here, tune in next week when we delve into it and see what's there. Hopefully it's not just a, like, very small dungeon like um, the Jack the Ripper thing or that subway from last episode. That would just be wrong, wouldn't it? So, tell everyone, bye for now.